In the years leading up to retirement and immediately after you start accessing your retirement portfolio, the ups and downs of your returns or market volatility has the greatest impact on the longevity of your portfolio and can lead to sequence of returns risk. Taking the proper action ahead of time can help mitigate this risk and ensure your retirement income lasts as long as possible. What is sequence of returns risk? Sequence of returns risk is the order in which you receive market returns. If the market is volatile, the sequence of returns will cause the value of your portfolio to fluctuate. As you prepare for retirement, sequence of returns matters less because your focus is on long-term savings. If you experience a down year during this accumulation phase, there is time to balance it out with a potential increase in future years since you are not yet taking withdrawals. Once you enter the retirement distribution phase and start drawing an income, market fluctuation and sequence of returns become a risk factor, making the timing of your withdrawals more important because it can impact the amount of income you receive in retirement. At the beginning of this phase, negative returns are magnified because they are based on a higher overall value without time to recoup those downturns in the market, especially as you continue to take withdrawals. This can have a lasting negative effect. How big of an impact can sequence of returns have on retirement income? Let's demonstrate the potential effect sequence of returns can have on your retirement income by comparing two hypothetical scenarios. Starting with a $1 million nest egg, you plan to withdraw 5% per year, $50,000, assuming a 3.5% annual adjustment for inflation. In scenario A, we'll use the sequence of annual returns and we'll repeat this sequence until your retirement income is depleted. As you can see, the ups and downs of the market produce a 6% average return and retirement income lasting 36 years. In scenario B, you start with the same $1 million nest egg. You withdraw the same 5% per year and assume a 3.5% annual adjustment for inflation. However, now the sequence of returns is reversed, starting with the negative return in the first year and repeating until the retirement income is depleted. While the average return is the same, 6%, because withdrawals were started in a down market in scenario B, retirement income runs out in 23 years, 13 years less than starting in an up market in scenario A and providing around half of the total retirement income when adjusting for inflation. So, how can you help reduce sequence of returns risk? If you enter the distribution phase of retirement with all of your assets invested in the market, it can leave you vulnerable to the market volatility and sequence of returns risk. You and your financial professional should discuss whether repositioning a portion of your assets out of the market and into insurance products designed to address this risk is appropriate for you. These products can protect your principal and any prior gains you may have from a decrease in the market in exchange for receiving an interest credit based on positive market performance of a specified index. This allows you to benefit from market gains over the long term, which you can access as supplemental income in retirement and avoid or reduce market losses. Contact your financial professional today to learn more about sequence of returns risk and supplementing retirement income.